Hello, my name is William Eggington, and I'm going to show you the new plugin for Messiah Studio called FastMDD. It was written by Greg Malik. What FastMDD does is bakes the animation in Messiah Studio down into the MDD, MDD animation interchange format, and it does it in a really elegant one click way. Um, so I'm going to show you how this would work with a production environment that included Blender. Now the this scene is called Don's Dino and due to Messiah's Lightwave heritage it's using the Lightwave interchange format and unfortunately Blender doesn't seem to enjoy using that as much as Lightwave does and so it's usually better to switch that out to OBJ and to do that really quickly, you just go into setup mode so that it's in its default bind pose. And then right click on file and pick save object and then pick the uh, wavefront OBJ file format. And then uh, I've already done that and exported that out and imported it into Blender. So you can see it there. So back in Messiah, click on animate. And what we need to do, actually click on File, what we need to do is replace this Lightwave object out with the OBJ file. So I'll just click Replace, or once I have the object selected, I'll click Replace, and then pick the OBJ, click Open, and all I need to do to get that to be animated is to go into Setup and back out to Animate, and that rebinds the bones with the mesh. And just click uh, press tab on the keyboard to switch that back into sub-D mode. And so when you scrub around you see that the dinosaur is walking around and we have it now with an OBJ file instead of the, the um, Lightwave object that's included with Messiah. So let's check the uh, frame out, just make sure that it's not too long of an animation so we're not waiting too long. So I switch that over to be 300, 300 frames. So, with the object selected, to bake the MGD, all you need to do, as the uh, um, tooltip suggests, just left click to capture. And that's capturing all the points of the mesh into the MGD animation format. And we'll just let that finish. And there we are, it's done. And now over in Blender, to apply that, just make sure you have the object selected. Click File, Import, and then pick the Load MDD to Mesh option. And then just go ahead and find where the file saved out. I had it saved within the content directory of the included content of the, my default install in my Scenes folder. So there it is there. So we'll just import that and it's going to offset that one frame so you just understand that that's going to happen. And click OK and it's just in, it says it's importing up there and it's done. So now you just click press Alt A and you can see that the animation has successfully been imported into Blender where you can go ahead and uh, do all your fluid dynamics and fur and all the great things that uh, Blender is great at and hopefully between the two applications you can get a really interesting unique pipeline and uh, have your animations really stand out. So hopefully that's uh, given you a little glimpse as to the power of FastMDD and Messiah Studio. Thank you.